Okay, so we got to talk about this food thing. What is like your favorite meal to eat? And then second, what is the most you've ever eaten in your life really? on a sitting? Really? Like, let's start. What, what's your favorite meal? If you could have any meal on the planet from home, home cooked, a restaurant, what would it be? Probably, well, I want to say enchiladas, but everybody <laughs> already knows I'm obsessed. Either that or macaroni and cheese. Macaroni but, and cheese is bomb. Yes, homemade mac and cheese, though. Yeah. It's better. <laughs> and what, what's the most you've ever eaten? Like, is there a time that you remember that you were just like, you sat down? Well, probably what they described in that video. That was an actual meal that I ate. Okay. It was actually half of Nico's meal, and I finished it. So. Okay. so you eat a lot. You don't see it, but you eat a lot. And then. Yeah. <laughs> I would hope not. No, not at all. And then for you, Mr., so what's the last movie that made you cry? Movies don't really, okay, movies make me cry. I don't remember the last one. More of, like, things that make me cry are, like, personal things. Yeah. Like, um, something, like, with family or, like, a sad song. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, anything that, when I see people cry, I cry. I like in the description, you're like, yeah, I'm really strong and tough. And I was like, and humble. <laughs> no, <laughs> thank you, thank you. I try, but, yeah, I don't know. I'm uncontrollable when I start crying. And I had to tweet because your um, dance to save your life was amazing, the music, everything. What was the inspiration behind that? Because it almost was like you were going to kill someone and wrangle bulls. <laughs> and gladiator. And gladiator. Uh, the bulls wrangling the bulls. No. <laughs> um, I think that uh, whenever we, whenever Nigel explains how to do a dance for your life, he says you have to actually dance for your life. Yeah. And I feel that the more powerful I am, the more, America, the more I look better. So, Paso is one of the most powerful dances in ballroom, so I decided to do a Paso Doble. That's why I did it. The music I really like. It's very, like, inspirational. Very epic. Yeah, it was. <laughs> so. and, then, and then tonight, I mean, you looked like a superhero. You have to watch the performance back, because you looked like a, like a hip-hop superhero. Like, your hair, everything. Um, how did that costume and the music and Dave Scott's choreography make you feel different than you feel right now? So, what did it kind of bring out of you? Yeah, I mean, I definitely felt like I was on another planet. <laughs> like this whole metal thing I had going on. Yeah. yeah, I was digging it. I was just feeling it, in it, to win it. <laughs> and Carly Ray said you were her favorite. Carly Ray said to us no. you were her favorite. Absolutely. Okay, I'm going to die. <laughs> yeah. Carly Ray Jepsen. Yes, she said you were her favorite. She said she couldn't take her eyes off you. Well, she's so nice, and I'm a huge fan, so I'm dying. She's amazing. Now, what are we going to do to get you more gangsta? That was I so nice. Alan, don't you don't have any hood in you at all? I thought I did. I thought I did. Apparently I don't. No. So we just have to hope to not like get hip hop again or or we gotta take you out to like the streets for a week or something. I think I'm gonna sleep outside tonight. Okay. Get, get a little hood with it. Alleyway. Yes. Sleep in the alleyway. You gotta get you a little hood with it. You you was a little but it's so funny because watching you dance it was like it was like you how you dance mixed with hip hop and it just I don't know. It, it's okay. You'll be around. You'll do well. You were in the bottom this week, um, but you'll be around. It was nerve-wracking, right? Yeah. Yeah. Very nerve-wracking. Well, they saved you. That's all that matters. Thank you. Thank right. you, judges. Yeah, so let's not get him in the bottom. I'm and the Vote. Yeah. Come on. Vote. Go Please. Keep them around. And hopefully we'll see him next week. <laughs> Thank, right. you. Thank you.